Alrighty, absolutely welcome back on the hashtag Why in the Morning. I'm Brian Sanko. This is the last conversation of the day. Still, let us know where you're watching us from. Now we're being joined live in the studio by a very powerful guest. He is the CEO of Radiant Orient Limited, Larry Muruki, who is going to actually uh, give us insights on how to not only just get to school, get your degree and, you know, create a CV and send it to a company, but how to be innovative and get to work that entrepreneurship journey with skills. And he also mentioned to me that he does capacity building. So many interesting insights of wisdom and nuggets of wisdom as well that is going to give us. Karibu sana, Mr. Larry. Thank you. Right. Now, just shortly a brief background of yourself. Uh, I understand you come from the you know, finance sector and, and the banking sector, rather, sure. with a lot of years and experience. Just briefly, your story. Thank you, Brian, for having me today. I'm Larry Muriuki, official Lawrence Muriuki in Jiru. Right. So Larry is, oh, Larry is an AKA, an AKA alias. AKA and alias. <laughs> That's what I use for right. a lot of my business and uh, mm -hmm. communication. Right. Yeah, I'm a uh, former banker. Right. I've been working in the bank for the last 13 years and uh, right. left the bank in 2021. Right. That's a decade and three years on top. Can imagine. And mm -hmm. after realizing that. Uh, you know that dream of go to school, yes. get a degree, get a certificate, go sort for employment, mm -hmm. see somewhere, yeah. work, get paid, mm -hmm. eight to five, go yes. home, sit, mm -hmm. wait for the foreign day, yeah. two, five, seven, everything else, you just wait to be told what to do. Yeah. And uh, I think that's, that's some of the background we've found ourselves as being yeah. uh, mm -hmm. as, uh, as we are growing up. Yeah, but and I it's a narrative that needs to change. It's needs to change. Yeah, but and I don't blame anyone. I don't blame mm -hmm. my parents for uh, mm -hmm. that song, Amuka Kijana and Asoma. Amuka and the Shule. Yes, you know, Upate Masoma, we the Shule. All those type of things. I don't blame them because uh -huh. that was what was happening then. Right. Because systems were not in place. There were no information. There all. It's just whatever was formed either from yeah. the government. The government mm -hmm. actually used to give a lot of opportunities, mm. uh, corporates uh, that used to be there, are just a few of them, but when right. you look at the economies and the role of things that happened that time, yeah. most of these was that uh, a few companies, yes. a few institutions, government right. uh, opportunities, that's all right. there. So mo if, if you wanted to do whatever you want to do is just get a qualification, right. get a government job, yes. become a police, a teacher yes. in an hospital, government hospitals, that, that was that way, but uh, I've, I've, uh, I've grown in the same system, went mm -hmm. to school, I thank God for my parents, yeah. got a degree in IT. Right. How, how many degrees do you have so far? Uh, <laughs> so far I have a degree in IT uh -huh. and I'm doing an MBA, strategic right. management. Right. Yes, I'm on so you're adding slowly by slowly. Uh, slowly by slowly. And several okay. certificates mm -hmm. throughout, out throughout my, my, my career life. Yes. Up to this today. Yes. So what happened is that uh, after, after I got to Imagine graduating an IT degree, uh -huh. there were no, in quotes, IT jobs as right. as then when I was right. graduating in some mm -hmm. mid-2020. Mm -hmm. uh, 2007, around yes. there. So uh -huh. you can imagine now, the only option that we had is tarmac. Right. I mm -hmm. added to a banking industry as a yes. sales rep. As a sales rep. Yes. Uh, which which bank was it back then? That was Standard Chartered Bank. <laughs> yeah, it's still strong. It's still moving yes, strong. Yes, 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 today. yes, yes. I think, we I think it's batch. among also the best. Yeah, among the first the first batch of the sales people, that mm -hmm. then sales jobs start right. uh, picking up. Everyone wanted to do sales, employ new graduates, do these things. Yeah. Then joined uh, KCB mm -hmm. as a sales rep, grew through the ranks mm -hmm. from uh, a sales rep into customer service rep credit uh, administrator, right. credit operations, grew mm -hmm. up up to assistant manager, mm -hmm. business banking, right. and then go to a business ma manager position, right. which I held alone for seven, seven years out of the 13 years I was in the bank. Right. Well, while I was doing that in the, in the, in the bank, I experienced and encountered a lot of guys, yeah. mm -hmm. customers. Right. So as a business manager, you deal with business people. Right. Uh, from the SME, from the micro, mm -hmm. medium, mm -hmm. the large corporates. Right. You sit with them, see their cash flows, you see whatever plans they have, everything else. Yes. And it, it became interesting. 
Yeah. So maybe what are some of the things that you learned so far that you can pinpoint till today that maybe some of them have advanced in the sector and some of them need to be changed? Now that you know, tech is here, technology is here, it's advancing each and every day. Sure, and sure, things sure. are moving very fast. Yeah, that, that's, that's even some of the things, uh, that's some of the things why, why I left banking because I came to realize we, we sit here and, uh, and I, I left banking and came up with an uh, organization, Lady and Audien, because I realized that people have aspirations. Right. But those aspirations cannot be realized if they don't know, if they don't know what is happening. Right. Yeah, because I saw a lot of change. Businesses that are working well in uh, late 2020, 20, mm. 10, today mm. they have collapsed, they're going out. Why? Right. Because these, they're not agile enough to understand what is happening in the market. Right. As you're saying, there is a, there, there, there is a, there, there is a, a flood of internet right. technology, mm -hmm. a lot of change of how things are being done. Now, now there's fintech. Everything else. Some of us, were, our jobs were yes. uh, threatened by some of those things. Right. And when you look back at the what it's good some, some of this came up because it's making uh, the, 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 the environment and whatever is happening around us a oh. bit uh, faster. Things right. are becoming easier to do. Right. Everything else is okay. Mm -hmm. But, but if, 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 if you are a traditional business person right. who still thinks on the traditional way of doing business, mm -hmm. you're going to be kicked out. Right. You're going to be overrun by yeah. the, 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 the tech. Oh, the tech. times are running they're like coming, it's flooding too they'll fast. Run over you. Yeah. They'll and run over and maybe also maybe for companies that are finding it hard to uh, innovate and adapt, because I remember the previous guest mentioned yes. stories that innovation and adapting. Yes. Uh, maybe uh, maybe things like a, a mentorship now comes in forums where you know think tanks come together to bring insights on you know how to go the way forward from here. How do we advance? How do we adapt? Uh, we have things like AI, artificial intelligence, That's that has now revolutionized revolutionalize literally every operation, even in medicine, in education, etc. Now you mentioned the part where you're offering also capacity building. So maybe if you can literally tell us maybe what happens in that space that you offer that service. So what happens, we, we, we do our forums. We, we, as our company, we specialize on uh, certain industries. Right. So like now when you get to uh, the, the catering industry, hotels and uh, uh, such type of industry, there's a specific technology specific uh, strategies specific uh, way of doing things that they can be able to agile and outlive and right. uh, outcompete and make sure that they are sustainable yeah so like also abandoning your previous operation yes <laughs> you, you <laughs> are sometimes you have to yeah. because uh, yeah. things have, 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 have really changed changed yes so so what, what we do as radiant we, we get uh, guys in a certain industry right we see them in a either a workshop or mm -hmm. a summit or a conference right or we meet individually to a company we, we approach a company and tell them right. this is what we do mm -hmm. so and we sit them down to go through their audit of their systems yeah auditing auditing you that audit part. your system from mm -hmm. your initial plans mm -hmm. uh, your, your 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 current operations yeah. whatever you're doing right and uh, the threats and the risks right that you you meet tomorrow yeah, in short, some short SWOT analysis in yes, there. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> we, we want to make ourselves to be a level five hospital for businesses. Right. <laughs> we do organizing, we make sure we give you prescription. Yeah. And, uh, you know, there is also, we also have uh, a, a maternity where a startup comes, mm -hmm. we need to tell them what they need to, what, what vaccines they need to vaccine themselves with. You need mm. to immunize yourself against a certain uh, way of operations. Yeah. To a point of, uh, we also have uh, post-mortems so right. of the businesses. So if a mm. business has gone to a point of uh, corruption, we sit down and try to mm. see what Evaluate happened. Evaluate literally. Yes. We what adopted, happened? Uh, what Why happened? did so the rain start beating? Yes. Yeah. So what happened to this? Because if, yes. if, if you're in a business and uh, your, 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 your colleague is has collapsed. Right. So we must be able to make sure that we, are, we, we, we pick from what has happened to the, your, your neighbor so that right. we, we are able to give that figure back to the next person so right. that they also don't go through the same fate. Right. Yes. Interesting. But also how do you filter, for example, you know, like you can tell this is a serious entity. This one, you need, a little, you need to mature Kidogo because 
uh, and yeah, well, you're still a baby. How do you feel to that professionally? Maybe do you have a team that works through that? Do you have machines now that there's technology? Or is maybe like just traditionally like, we can observe this, I sit with the person here, hear their mind out and be like, yes, no. Sure, it's, it's, it's nice, I breed of both. Mm -hmm. You look at the people and also the persons, the owners of the business, and also the system they have in, the technology that they are using in, is that you just do an hybrid of the same. Because right. as long as uh, technology is coming, there's one thing that you cannot uh, alternately do away with, is the uh, human aspect right. in any business. Because mm -hmm. ideas come from human beings. Absolutely. S technology systems come to make sure that they help you implement the same ideas. Right. So what, what happens, I've come to realize sometimes mm -hmm. as a business people, there are a lot of why is why you start a business. Right. Some is because either their father had enough money mm. and uh, they went to school. So there is that capital that's lying around. It is your colleague, your, 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 your classmate is doing great thing in, let's say, uh, entertainment. Yeah. You get yourself a uh, entertainment uh, track, right. uh, systems, everything else you want to do events. Right. You see? The why is what makes us uh, shift mm -hmm. the serious people from mm -hmm. people that are just uh, joy yeah. leaders yeah. in business. Because mm -hmm. another thing, Brian, you need to, uh, our under Kenyans need to understand is that entrepreneurship is not an emotional journey. Mm. Mm -hmm. Entrepreneurship is not uh, hype. Right. It's not uh, pop and color. Pop and color, all those <laughs> things. Mm -hmm. It requires discipline, mm -hmm. self discipline. You need to know what you're doing. Right. Because there's those nights. Yeah. If you, if you want to make it, there are those nights that you need to spend alone. There right. are sometimes even you, you need to handle customers, delicate cut customers. Yes. You need to handle your uh, stakeholders. That mm -hmm. is uh, uh, your suppliers, right. they are uh, government, a lot of things. Yes. So it's not uh, s s glamorous and everything else, you know, mm -hmm. yeah. it's, it's, it's not an entertainment area. It's, no. it's a very it's serious, a serious thing. thing. It's a serious mm -hmm. thing. Serious thing yeah. And that's why you need, you, need, you need to make sure that all, all your, your, your systems are in place and there is enough discipline because yeah. in whatever is happening in entrepreneurship, it's yeah. uh, you are burning the finance. midnight oil uh, finance right you said it you're, yeah. fin you're burning money right either you burn to make more yes or you burn <laughs> to lose it to lose it <laughs> so it's a risk in short that's, that's what you're true. trying it's to say risk. Actually, that's it's a entrepren risk uh, entrepreneurship what they do eh? uh -huh. you 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 weigh your you 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 get a business idea yes you do the sort uh, sort analysis right you 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 weigh the cost of the risk right versus Mm -hmm. the, 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 the output out of the risk. Yeah. If, 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 if revenue or if uh, the benefit outweighs the risk, mm -hmm. you go ahead, do yeah. the same. But if you don't... If the risks outweigh the benefits, then uh, it's a bad idea. Even it's if everyone idea. is telling you go, yeah. you must make sure that at, risk, at the end of the day, you are able to be sustainable. Right. Because as I said, it's not a show yeah. base. It's not a show base. Right. Mm -hmm. You know, of course, you, you, you may be in showbiz business mm -hmm. where mm -hmm. you need to make sure people are happy. It's business, but on a show. <laughs> <laughs> As it's you called know, showbiz. Yeah, yeah you, 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 you may be in a showbiz business. People are doing showbiz mm -hmm. business. Eh? But right. as an entrepreneur, be at that business. Mm -hmm. You don't go to an event, a venue to be happy. Right. You do your, your, your numbers right. before even you set up an event. Right. Why? Because it's those risks versus the gains. Yeah. So doing research to get a know-how. Literally, it's like doing a, was it, is, it, is it a thesis where you're doing a reconnaissance? You go on ground on location, you survey, you take notes, da 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 At the end of the day, you come up with a final synopsis, right? Yes. Exactly. Yeah, uh -huh. yeah because, because uh, f at the end of the day, we need you 10 years from now. Yes, absolutely. We need, we need a business. Right. You see, there's something else that people need to understand is that uh, do something for posterity. Right. Mm -hmm. Posterity. And, and that's why now why, the why comes in. Right. So you now be able to, uh, from your mind, from whatever you're doing, when you sit down and say, now I'm going to do a hardware shop. Mm -hmm. Why the hardware shop? Why, 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 why? Also, who is your target market, really? Yes, all yeah. those things. Ah. And uh, who, who is the supplier? What are the margins? Right. 
What mm -hmm. is uh, the status of that business two, three years from now? Mm -hmm. You know, most of the time, I think we don't even look at it like two, three years from now. We're <laughs> like, let me just start. If it works this month, Nikipata some little profit, I'm good. But you just don't know what could happen next week, right? And that, 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 that's the problem. That's the problem we have around every one of us. Mm -hmm. You see, our parents, our colleagues, the government, everyone else telling you, go do entrepreneurship, go yeah. be an start a business. Start a business. Mm. Young people check the, take the Asla fad, yeah. do get, buy some smokies and eggs, mm. do these things. But you don't know, when I get this 5,000 after two, three days, mm. what will happen f to me like a year from now? Yeah. Is mm. it sustainable? Right. So because if, 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 if mm -hmm. that's not possible, you're, yes. going to, you're, you're, you're going to be yes. frustrated. And you need to change. You need to adapt and change. Yeah. That's the thing. So right. there is those uh, academic mm -hmm. uh, ideas we, we, we have, those uh, romantic issues yeah. about business. Right. Getting the <laughs> next, the, the next, the next uh, <laughs> big the, thing in town. In town, <laughs> you're the one, you know, you're yeah. the best media, you know, those type of right. things. Yeah. I'm sure th there's a lot of things. That there's a lot of hype around that. Yes, yeah. so there is a lot of background. Uh -huh. uh, works that need to be done. They need to be done. To every individual, and that's why, yeah. as, as a radiant, we came in to make sure that uh, with uh, for, with the, with the, uh, with, uh, with help with some uh, two of my colleagues, we mm -hmm. sat down and we, we say now we need to get to this field and yes. trying to tell Kenyans, right, and uh, our fellow brothers and sisters, yes, that uh, yes, it's possible. Yes, and true. And <laughs> I also believe an, an idea looks good on paper until it, it comes to its implementation so that it comes to manifest. That's when you realize you need it to change. And I'm glad that people like you are there to shape you know, the mindsets of people. Now, let's talk about capital uh, and delve also into finance and, and much more. Starting, starting up uh, some of these businesses requires you to have resources and our capital. And I remember there's a guest I interviewed, I think, yeah, early in the year. She told me, she, I think she's a CEO of a painting company, she said, never rely on borrowed money, and that is loans. So uh, from your experience and what you've observed, is it a good idea to borrow money from a bank, start a business? It could go well. Sometimes it doesn't. <laughs> Not always the ones that have started on loans have failed. The success stories as well. So what is your mindset on that? Sure, I've, I've been banking, I've lent loans and uh, analyzed customers, give them facilities to grow their business. But uh, to surprise you, uh, I don't advocate for loans, business loans, business uh, loans. for startups. Mm -hmm. uh, right. Many financial institutions do not give startups working loans. capital to start their business. Mm -hmm. They fund uh, already existing, existing and established, <laughs> established sustainable business. Because they, they have a track record and a history, right? That's true. Mm -hmm. So what is the option? Mm -hmm. An option is um, either you do saving. Right. You see, as I said in the beginning, is that uh, you need to do risk gain an analysis. Right. So if, if, you, if you're sure you are determined and you're disciplined enough to know that now I can get to entrepreneurship and I have an idea that I can turn it to a product and a service that is, yes. is, is able to sustain itself. Yes. Get yourself some savings. If not savings, there are other ways of starting a business without capital. Yes, which are, please. <laughs> I know somebody will be interested. That would be a good one. Ziko mingi sana. Like? As long as you have an idea, ziko mingi sana. There is one business that people for a long time have hated and uh, thought is not right because I think, and it, 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 it has, it has, uh, it, it has laid foundation for many. If you see tarot of people that are no money and they uh, manage to be where they are today, it's something they call uh, e broker issue. Kuwa broker mm, and then yes. become an agent. Right. A lot of politics in there. Yes. <laughs> A broker, agent, you know, yes. like uh, you don't have money, but you have time. Right. Someone has a product. Mm -hmm. And now there are customers, you come in between. Right. You see, uh, you have a suit like yours, mm -hmm. a customer in a pile, they don't know that, uh, where to get the suit, you right. know yourself. 
Mm. You don't have the money to buy it. Yeah. Go talk to the one who has the suit. Talk to him. Tell him what is uh, the selling price. Mm. Right. Give me one hour. Repart your suit. Mm -hmm. Get to the customer. Right. Put your margin. Mm -hmm. Right. The one of the name. And then you move on. Yeah. Continue uh, in a trade until you become you, you, you have enough savings on the same. Right. That, that's that's our brokerage. That's like some advanced type of butter trade. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Right. Or agency, become an agent. Mm -hmm. Insurance agent, uh, a bank agent, Safaricom agent, you know, with a 20 key with a line. Yeah. And uh, you, 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 you are able to, uh, if you are disciplined enough with, with some few days, few years, you are able to make sure that you are able to offer service that's not yours. Mm -hmm. What are you aiming at? Right. You have a business idea that you need to implement. Unfortunately, right. you don't have cash. Mm -hmm. So what happens is that now, with, 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 with your agent service, whatever you're doing, mm -hmm. you save money. Mm -hmm. A lot of uh, young people, graduates, are doing a lot of online jobs. Yes. It's not betting the uh, lighting, proofreading, yeah. a lot of sites that enables you to do online Business, uh, businesses jobs and opportunities. Yeah. Even today, I think on our intro, we highlighted the government, the government has launched one called Finya Finya to a dollar. <laughs> it's an interesting one, uh, following the president's uh, yes, highlight yes, of the sure, Vermont sure, task. Sure, sure, yeah. Sure. Yeah. So it's really interesting. It's, it's also going to help young people to yes. tap into that you yeah, know, because, tech space. Yeah. Because some of these young people, they are just from college. Right. They have a help loan. Mm -hmm. uh, their parent cannot be able to sustain them in Nairobi or wherever they are, in the end, every part of the county, uh, within the country. Yes. So you don't need to sit and start worrying mm -hmm. in frustrations and anything else. Right. This happens to young people even to us who have left employment to come and do entrepreneurship. Yes. Uh, to surprise you, I started some two businesses that I left immediately in around 2021. The banking sector you left. Yes. Uh -huh. Did but they I, flourish? But I found one. <laughs> Were there tough times? <laughs> 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 How did you weather? <laughs> Kwa ground story ni ingine. Kwa ground things are different. Yeah, yeah. Well, one is on, one is on because of uh, that you try to do your list and uh, yeah. Gain analysis and uh, you drop one. And what kind of businesses were they? One, I, I, I got into selling of cement and steel. Right. That's construction materials. Yes, 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 yes. Mm -hmm. uh, as, as, Supply? As supplying. Mm -hmm. I, I was acting as an agent and a salesperson for mm -hmm. one of my former friend that has a very good hardware. All right. So, mm -hmm. in the process of doing that, you, 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 customers, you know, uh, price wars and other things. You find that uh, as long as you may want to continue doing this, yeah. as I do, I'm doing my consultancy. You know, I need to do some fueling and do one, two, three things for my own. Eh? You yes. see, you thought you are able to work on. Eh? I realized, uh, uh, unfortunately, there was the, the economy was not good. 2022. Yes. Up to today. So it never... Actually, to, uh, you it's, it's, to it's, it's, recover from yes, pandemic, yes, 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 yes. but still look warm. The, the, yeah. the, 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 the is still there, but it's not as promising right. as I thought. Promising. So I got right. into another one that is, uh, uh -huh. I do now stationary and packaging materials. Right. That one is still sustainable. It's, it's still working? It's working. I'm still doing right. it today. Thank God. Uh, <laughs> you see, sometimes I, to, I tell people, uh, you don't just teach what you're not doing. Right. Because you, when, when you go down to the ground and you understand now these are the, mm -hmm. the, the, the things that need to, you need to do. Yeah. So if you are not uh, experienced in knowing what is happening, you're going to tell people theoretical things. Yeah, theoretical Those romantic words, motivations, <laughs> Word on speakers. Paper. You know, you yeah, become yeah. a motivation speaker on business. Yeah. Business yeah. is not about motivation. It's mm -hmm. about this pain, be able to know you are, uh, you are whatever uh, works and whatever right. does not work. Yeah, and it's real. It's not real. theory. Mm. It's really you, whatever works. You need to uh, know how to add to your customer. Exactly. You need to know how to add to your suppliers. You need mm -hmm. to know when to deliver when. Right. Your TATs and all those things. Right. So, 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 what I'm saying is that uh, we, yeah. we, 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 with that, uh, with the, the, we, we need to help ourselves, the young and people, young well. people, mm -hmm. and any, any of us, even those who are in big corporates. Right. They are being take, overtaken by startups. 
people. Right. You see, a starter comes today and they kick up In business. In six months, they've already... You yes, know. they kick up business. You'll be there with the traditional shop, traditional office, yes. a lot of staff, a lot mm. of uh, uh, bureaucracy, red tapes. You're still right. sitting and waiting. Yes. You'll be overtaken. So right. every one of us as a Kenyan, whether you're employed or not, you must be sure that you understand there mm. is a certain paradigm shift that happens yeah. within the, 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 the business uh, yes. uh, space. And right. it's high time you, under, you, you come to know mm -hmm. what will happen tomorrow. All right, cool. Thank you. But then I'm being, we are literally out of time, Mr. Lawrence. I would have loved us to extend this conversation for like 20 minutes. But uh, I also understand the conversation about money. Uh, sure. Financial literacy. We are never taught early. You know, you come, you want to start a business, but you don't know how to handle money, which I feel like is a very key and integral part in, sure. in that space. Sure. But we have to go. So definitely if people that are watching right now yeah. and they want to access your services, they want to get your expertise and also hear what you've just said right here, where can they get? Is there an email, a website, etc.? This is your camera. Thank in you. In 20 seconds. Thank you. Uh, you can get uh, us on uh, we have a Facebook page, Lori uh, Radiant Orient. You can also uh, call us on 0727887713. Anytime you want our services, anytime you want us to sit together and uh, talk as a group, as an individual company. And uh, I think we'll be have a word of time to make sure that we diagnose our issues and also give good descriptions for sustainability. All thank right. you. All right. Thank you for sharing your insights. It's a really riveting conversation. You sure. Karibu sana. Now, that's where we put a period, not even a comma. So on behalf of everybody, including my co-host, Stephanie Ayeta, we say thank you so much for watching. And you can continue to engage with us on socials. Today, we don't have time to sample feedback, but we'll sample it off the air. <laughs> continue to engage with us at Y244 channel, at Brian Sakwana 1, and at Stephanie Ayeta. Thank you for watching, and we'll definitely see you next time.